Hey guys, this is Jcart's MCPE back for another video. And uh today I'm gonna show you guys something really, really cool. Uh it is a security chest, as you guys saw in the title. Um it is um it's uh basically just a ginormous redstone contraption, you know, without pistons, because this is something that requires no mods, therefore iOS and Android can both play this simultaneously. So, um, uh, let's, uh, get down, uh, to the video, uh, real quick. Uh, actually, before we get down to the video, I just want to say, guys, that, uh, this, um, was not made by me. It was made by someone else, so I will leave a link in the description below, uh, of who did, uh, make this video, or I will leave a link in the description below of the video that, uh, I saw this in, and, uh, also of the, uh, video of the person who made this. So, uh, let me, uh, go ahead and show you guys, uh, before, uh, I show all this orientation of items, uh, and how to make it, let me show you guys how it works. So, uh, let me switch out of, uh, third, third person real quick. So, there we go. Okay, so, um, this chest is really, really cool. So, basically, what it is, is it is a combination chest so you need a combination in order to unlock the chest so uh my combination is where both uh torches are looking uh inward towards this chest so uh when the combination is correct these redstone lamps will turn on uh and items will go into this large chest so if i turn it on those lamps will turn on and items will be dropped into the chest, uh, essentially from that chest down there on the bottom. If you unlock it, uh, all the items that are in this chest will uh, start going out. So uh, that is basically how the chest works, but uh, you want to know, if you want to know how to, um, how to uh, make your own combination, this is how you do it from the back of the device. So basically how it works is, uh, you, uh, the combination has to be, uh, one less or one more than these here. So, uh, the combination up there, as you saw, was, uh, both of them facing t right towards the chest. Well, this here, this is one back from the one over there, and this is one backwards from the one over there. So that is how that works. So, uh, really cool. Uh, if you mess around with it enough, you'll, you'll probably understand that concept. So, uh, just, uh, as a start, you can probably have both of these here like this, and then, uh, have that same combination that I had up here in order to, uh, have a base of understanding. So, yeah, just like this, both of these in here, equivalent to these two over here, just like this. And, uh, that is how the device works. Uh, really simple, really neat. I'm gonna go ahead and lock this back. But, um... Here we go. Let us go ahead and uh, I'll begin showing you guys how to make this. So uh, here is all the materials you're gonna need. You're gonna need glass, but uh, that's just for me, so you guys can see through the uh, through the platform. Uh, it can be any block at all. Then you're gonna need an item frame and a block that can be uh, that you can place an item frame on. So that's why uh, I put this up here. Item frames can be placed on glass. So. Uh, you know, for you guys, you probably won't want to use glass, or if you do, then you're probably going to need another block uh, that glass can be placed on. So, um, then you're going to need redstone torches, you're going to need wool, or at least I used wool, you can use any block actually. Uh, then you're going to need redstone, you're going to need redstone repeaters, redstone comparators, redstone, uh, not redstone droppers, but just droppers. Uh, not dispensers, droppers. Then you're going to need hoppers, uh, chests, and redstone lamps. So uh, now that you know the materials you're gonna need, let's go ahead and get on with the video. So uh, this platform here that I made, in case you just wanna know, is a five by six platform. So there's five here this way, and then there's uh, six here the other way, that way. Uh, and then I just put three uh, up here for the wall of the uh, locked chest. So um, let's go ahead and begin with the redstone. So, uh, for the, um, for, uh, the circuits, I used wool, so I'm gonna go ahead and take that out and place that 
in my inventory. So uh, what we're going to do first, guys, is we're going to make the basic circuit. So uh, go ahead and place four here and then four here. Okay, so that's going to look like this. Then you're going to place four here this way. And uh, now it looks like that. And you're going to place one diagonally up like this. So you have uh, something that looks, looks like this. Do it on the other side as well. And now you have this. So uh, from there, go ahead and place uh, go ahead and place two here and then uh, two right here. And then break those first two that I showed you there. And now you have uh, that. And then from there, uh, you're going to want to go up again diagonally from here like this. Then break these two blocks here. So like that. And then you're going to want to go down diagonally again. Like this here. And now from here you have a design that looks like this. So there you go. Take a good gander at this. Night, night, now you get to see how it looks. Uh, so uh, now that you got that, go ahead and go down one and place two here. So play, get rid of those two that, that you placed. And up, uh, then up, uh, place one there and place one there. So now you have that. And uh, then you're going to want to uh, wanna go down here like this. So get uh, rid of that and then get rid of that and place two right here. So there you go. Now you have all this. Then you're going to want to go two blocks down here, place one block there and get rid of these two. Then you're going to want to go three blocks over. So now you have these three here. And then uh, from there, place one block up and then place one block uh, up again. And that'll be two blocks there. And then from there, you're going to want uh, four blocks here. Get rid of that block. Uh, nothing should be there. And then place four here like this. Place one here. And then place one here. And he uh, sorry. Place one here and here. And then you have this. You have this design here. So this is the circuit for your uh, security, redstone security chest. So um, next up, what you're gonna need are some redstone repeaters and comparators. And I'm gonna show you guys where you need to put those. So uh, then you're going to, uh, from here, you're gonna wanna place one here and one here, both activated. And then you're gonna want comparators here and here. Make sure the orientation of these comparators are correct or this will not work. Uh, then you're gonna wanna place two redstone repeaters here, and then you want to go uh, down here to this part of the design. Uh, from here, you're going to want to place a redstone comparator here, facing this way, and then you're going to want a repeater here, facing that way, and uh, let's see, I think that's it. Oh no, we still have one more, and that one more goes right there, facing in that direction. And just for the future, guys, go ahead and uh, break these six blocks here. So, uh, oh, no, four blocks, my bad, guys. Hang on, give me, give me a sec, give me a sec. I uh, accidentally broke some blocks that we didn't need to break. So these here. Uh, get rid of these four blocks here, making a four by four empty space there. And uh, then I believe that is all we need for the comparators and repeaters. So now we're done with that. Uh, then uh, the reason I wanted you guys to uh, break these uh, these blocks uh, down over here is because uh, that is going to be where our next step is. So uh, you might want to get rid of this chest for this just to make it easy easy on yourself. Uh, get a block for for your for the base. Uh, of what you're of what you're gonna do this on, so um, like a right here. So there you go. And uh, get some. You're gonna want uh some droppers, uh, hoppers, chests, and uh the redstone lamps that I was talking about earlier. So uh, go ahead and get those. Uh, 
So now, uh, with the droppers here, you're going to want to go up, uh, crouch, and put three up facing up this way. So the hole should be facing up like this. And then you're going to want a hopper connected to this, uh, to this dropper down here. So like this, the bar down here should be connecting to the uh, dropper like that. And then you're gonna want a chest here. Oops, my bad. Crouch and put a chest here like this. And then you're probably gonna want another one right here. Uh, so that way you have uh, maximized space. So I'm gonna just create a little platform here for me to, uh, for me to place, oop, my bad. My bad guys, my bad. Trying to uh, do this the best I can. There we go. You're gonna wanna probably place another chest right here. So that way you have maximized space there, like that. And then from there, uh, you probably wanna break these uh, now because you don't need them anymore. They were just base blocks. Uh, then you're gonna want to put a hopper right here, uh, uh, facing the chest or connecting to the chest. That bar down there is facing the chest or connecting to the chest. And then you can place that chest right back down on top of those two blocks. And there you go. So uh, from here, I believe uh, there are only two things missing. The redstone and uh, the combination maker back there that I was showing you. So uh, go ahead and place redstone here. Uh, here, oh, also we're missing redstone torches. So that's also very important. Uh, redstone here, here, so now you have this here this here, uh, four there, and one here, one here. And then you're going to want from there, I believe you're gonna want uh, some here, uh, down there, and last but not least, you're going to want uh, redstone all throughout there. And that, I believe, is all the redstone you are going to need for this device. So uh, now you're gonna want the redstone torches, go ahead and take those out, place uh, two there, to here uh i think i remember guys that we're supposed to place a uh, redstone here but i'm not sure i am not completely sure no no we we don't i don't think so uh yeah yeah we do we do so we place one here and one here okay so there we go and then you're going to want a redstone torch there redstone torch there here and uh, here, and I forgot a block, guys. I forgot a uh, a, a piece of wool here. Uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, and get that block here. Let's see here. So uh, I'm I'm looking for wool, guys. By the way, so here we go. There we go. That's where the wool is. That's where the wool is. All right, and place that wool right. Uh, you're gonna want to place that wool here. So let me ask. Uh, Crouch down, place that wool there. And now you're going to want a redstone torch right there. And uh, I believe those are all the redstone torches that you are going to need for uh, this design. And finally, all you're going to need is uh, your orientation or uh, password creators. So, um, this is necessary, just like everything else in here, but, uh, let's go ahead and let me find those item frames. That's what I'm looking for, guys, the, the item frames. There we go, there's the item frame, and then we're gonna need those redstone torches, wherever they are. Here they are, they're, they're down here. Oh, well, I already have that in my, uh, inventory, so let's go ahead and, uh, place, uh, one here and one here. And put your torches uh, in here like this and then put uh, the combination that you want in there just like this so that is my combination that I had the uh, other time and uh, if you want to unlock oops if you want to unlock the chest then you're just gonna have to put that combination that you put in there and oh we I forgot one thing guys one thing I forgot one thing so uh here place uh, redstone lamps here so that way you know if you have it unlocked or not so there you go and uh, that is the last step that is the last step guys just placing those those uh, redstone lamps there and uh, then it is done okay so now uh, just put the combination in 
and yep there we go that turns on and see, no items are coming in the chest because we don't have any items ready that we, you know we want to go in so you know you can just place items here like this into that chest there and when this is unlocked items will begin filling in and if you unlock it items will be begin dispensing back out as you can see that number is slowly decreasing but decreasing and uh that is it for creating your cool minecraft 14.0 security chest so uh thank you guys uh so much for watching uh i really really appreciate it that, that you guys are watching these videos uh if you guys like this like subscribe do all that stuff share my videos because um i really hope that i can make videos for everyone that they all enjoy and uh i hope to see you guys later so um see you guys i'll see you later